In this video, I am going to show you how to create a median if formula in Google Sheets. So there's not a built-in median if function in Google Sheets. What you actually need to do is combine the median and if functions together to create your own. And so this might come in handy if you have a data set and you want to find the median for different values only for data that meets certain criteria. And so in this example, I have various products and I have the department they belong to and sales for each product. And what I'm going to do is create a median if function that will provide the median for each department. And so it's like doing several formulas in one. If you were to, without a median if formula, do this manually, you would have to run um, you'd have to basically sort this and run multiple median functions. What I can do by creating a median if formula is I can do this all in one step. So before I show you how to do this, I'm going to show you the syntax of the function first. So this is going to be the syntax that we're going to use. So it's an array formula and within the array formula there's median and then if and then I have my criteria range equals my criteria and then the median range. So the criteria range is the range that contains the criteria that you want to check for. So in my example, this is going to be my criteria range. I want to find the median for each department, for the sales of each product in each department. So this is going to be my criteria range. And then your criteria is the criteria that you want to use to run the median function on. So the criteria in this example is going to be each department. And then lastly, you have your median range. And this is the range that contains the numbers that you will use to find the median. And so this is a combination of both the median and if functions. So it's helpful to know how both of these functions work. So the median function is pretty simple because it just works on a cell range. So I'll just do the median function here to show you how it works. So median and I input my cell range and you can see the median is two, which is what it should be. So median is very simple. If is a little bit more complicated, but it's still simple. So if this is the first um, argument of the function is your logical expression. And then is, if this is true, you can return a value here. If it's false, you can return a different value. So let me just show you how to do this. I will do a two here. And let's do equals if this cell equals two is two and if it's false, it is not two. So basically what this does is if the logical expression is true, then we return this. So this is your value if true. If it's false, return this. This is the value if false. So that's how the if function works. I'll just change this so it's not true. And you can see that changes because now we're false. So we're returning value if false. Now in the context of median if, <clears throat> how this is going to work is I have the median function and inside the median function I have the if function. So we're gonna do a median and then if the criteria range equals my criteria, then here is the median range. And then we don't have a value if false in this if function because you don't really need one, it's optional. We're only trying to find the median, so I do not have that argument in this if function. So this seems a little more complicated than it really is. I will actually show you how to use this now on my example, and it will make things a lot more clear. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm gonna create two new columns where I'll end up doing my calculation. So I have department, and this one will be median sales. So the first thing I need to do is I need to create a unique list of my criteria. 
and so my criteria is the department so I can either manually type out each department or what I'm going to do is use the unique function on this cell range and this will return a list of the unique values so I only have three departments in this example and now I'm ready to do my formula that will um, be the median if formula so I have it down here the basic syntax so you can kind of follow along so it's equals array formula and then median if and then the first is my criteria range which is the department and I'm going to lock this in place by doing F4 equals so criteria range equals my criteria so that is going to be E2 because my criteria is the department so clothing and then the last argument is my median range which is going to be C2 to C13 in this example and I'll also lock that in place by pressing F4 on my keyboard and then you need to have your three closing parentheses so the median sales for our products in the clothing department is 23 so then once you have your first formula you can just copy it and you can paste it down if you have additional um, values that you need to calculate the median for and now with this median if formula that I've created I have now found the median sales for the products in each department so that is the median if function or it's the median if formula that we have created because there is not a built-in function so hopefully you followed along with that if you have any questions just let me know in the comments thank you for watching the video if you haven't already make sure to hit the subscribe button if you have any questions or content suggestions just let me know in the comments and i'll try my best to answer everyone